Hey everybody, so it is day 160 post-surgery of my Achilles uh, surgery slash heel spur surgery. I'd say overall everything's been going pretty darn good to say the least. Um, so I've started jogging probably, I'm jogging about three days a week now. now I am jogging on a treadmill. I've been doing that purposely just because uh, less ground and pound than on the street. I did run on the street a couple of times and it went well. Um, believe it or not, what's funny is I, the Achilles didn't give me any trouble. It was more of my quads and my stamina. Uh, I had run on the treadmill three times a week and I thought I can hit the ground running, no problem. And I started running and um, it was a uh, I guess I'm out of shape, but um, so my regimen has really been <clears throat> right now it was three days running on the treadmill, two days on the bike, kind of cut off the bike. Now I'm just doing treadmill and lifting weights Tuesdays and Thursdays, but um, the swelling, I'll let you look at my leg in a second. The swelling has gone. There's no swelling. The uh, bruising is all but gone. There's a little bit left. I don't know when that's going to go away. I mean, it looks it looks a lot better. But um, swelling has gone away. Even after I run, there's no swelling. There is a little bit of tightness. That tightness um, really is just when you put your foot and you extend it this way. Not, not at all this way, but just when you're stretching it that way, it, it feels a little bit tight. Yesterday after I ran during the day, when I was sitting at the desk most of the day, when I got up, it was a little bit sore, a little bit tight. So um, you could definitely feel that I've had some sort of surgery there, but everything's going good. <clears throat> um, I remember the doctor said that after a year, he was hoping that I could play basketball. Right now, I'm shooting for October. If I can play basketball again in October, then you're talking about, you know, I had, you know, maybe October 15th. I had surgery February 15th, so you're talking about eight months, you know, or so. February, um, March, April, May, June, July, August, so... Yeah, you're talking about seven or eight months, which, you know, maybe I'm being optimistic, but, you know, I'm feeling pretty good. You know, I, I haven't really, really pushed myself, like, cutting and doing things that you would normally do to play basketball, so I'm not really sure if I'm going to do that. I don't want to risk anything, but everything has been going really, really well. Um, as far as tips are concerned, one thing that I've been doing is a lot of stretching. Just get in there every morning, just stretch a little bit. Um, stretch it out, make sure everything's going good. One thing that I would say that I wish I would have said back then that the doctor told me to do, and I wish I would have recorded this in one of my earlier videos, is massage your scars. Massage your scars every day, as much as you can. And the reason why is because you're breaking down the scar tissue so it doesn't look bad. And, and for me, it's, that's not the issue, but for me, it's also because of the sensitivity of the scar area. So you want to massage that scar tissue area to get the sensitivity away or go, gone as much as possible. So I do that as much as I can. I always kind of forget because I forget that there's scar there, but... I've been massaging it every day, and I'll show you how it looks like right now. So, you know, there's a little bit of, you can tell there's a little bit of, of a darker area there and there. And there's the scar. scars right there so it's not too bad and on um, this side I can't see really any it's a little bit of swelling right there I think 
um, but it's very, very minimal. Another tip that I'd recommend, um, the doctor didn't really say anything about it, but I've been taking glucosamine sulfate at least once a day. Um, I've got two physical therapy buddies of mine who said, take it, it's only gonna strengthen your ligaments. So take that as much as you can. So other than that, don't have a whole lot more to report, really no setbacks or anything like that. Um, I will say there was one little setback that scared me. I hit a curb and um, kind of a little bit twi twisted my ankle because I missed a curb and it burned just a little bit. But I mean, I thought, you know, something like that, I'd snap it. But I think pretty much the Achilles is healed and it's just tight. So I don't know how hard it would be to snap it again but i'm not gonna take any chances so and then i'll report probably in another month or so i haven't really reported a whole lot recorded a whole lot it's because really nothing much has been going on i've just been trying to jog oh yeah well, so when i jog i normally jog about two to two and a half miles on the treadmill that's my regiment so and other than that i appreciate you watching and for all those who have the surgery you know it's a mind game just look at the uh, big picture um, because really it's just a mind game of, of how long it's going to take to heal and just not pushing yourself. Just let the healing process go and do its thing. So talk to you guys later.